Shy guy. Poor little Harvey. There's no fine fish go here, I couldn't hide. <laughs> Neither of us knew what we were doing. <laughs> we, we were like two cars and a hook bumpers, both of us pushing and pulling at the wrong time. <laughs> and, and, and he kept apologizing the whole time. I'm terribly sorry. I think he hoped I changed my mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know why I'm laughing. It was horrible. No passion. Guilt for him. Frustrated tears for me. He asked me to marry him. Couldn't have been to bed with me, so I should. <laughs> You know, he wasn't such a bad guy. <laughs> Meaning I'm not going to get any chance. Oh, Meaning I'm not going to get any chance. And here you go again. God. I didn't sleep with him, so he married me. We <laughs> made each other miserable. I you having dinner with us? You invite Megs over for dinner. You know, he's going to latch on to you. He's going to be coming by. He's going to be calling all the time. He's going to be telling me all kinds of crazy stuff. <laughs> I'm never going to be able to get rid of him. You're making a big mistake. <coughs> it's my mistake. Christ, why don't you listen to me? Do you know anything about men? No. You know, you'd have, a, you'd have a hard time handling the most perfect son of a bitch in the world, let alone this guy. All right. All right, all right. You'll see. You'll be back in the back in the leave. Go get cleaned up. You'll feel better. <laughs> well, now. Yeah. It's the backwards, isn't it? <laughs> oh, my. You like him? Uh, I told the guy with the white neck would be the fair damsel. Give me your best. You're beautiful. Boy, oh, yeah. Here. Oh, no. Yeah, oh. candy. Oh. Uh, just the mad seducer, that's me. <laughs> Boy, and I brought the wine. I had no idea what with, with what, so I, I got one of every color. <laughs> <laughs> Pink, <laughs> blood red, and white, and death. Brandy? Yeah. Oh, well, if you're for breakfast and sunrise, brandy is the sunset. Yeah, it looked pretty good at the store window, and I said, what the hell, from that, you know? <laughs> Real bad of your mind. Do you have anybody find anything? Bring me a moment of vengeance, you selfish son. All I want you to know is, I want you to see what he's like. That's right. I know what he's like. He's kind, and he's gentle, and we're having a wonderful time. He likes me. You didn't have to threaten to beat me, beat him up, and he didn't. What? The time you got me the prom date. Oh, jeez. That was done out of love and generosity, feelings you've forgotten about. You just want to keep me here so the house isn't empty on the rare occasions that you decide to come home. Well, I'm moving, David. I'm leaving. Like mother. All those tears she shed. Did you really believe they were all for Papa? Most of them were for you. You might as well have been dead, too. Don't you mind the them? You are sure. You know, you got the face of a football cleat. You could use a series of shots for this temper. And them telling you David doesn't make it so. Doesn't make it so! You should, David. I shouldn't what? Talk to someone who loves you like that, you shouldn't. I want you to tell me something. You don't have to tell he me anything. He does! What are you doing here? What are you planning on being lucky for my sister like you were for me? You were for the boss. Just leave, David. You know, he knows what I'm talking about. Well, what thought you mean? That you thought I was lucky? Or that you were so piss-ass screwed you held on to that luck like rosary beads? What I'm trying to figure out is why I'm standing here looking at your face instead of Bobby's. Get fucked. Oh, he ate it. Get him! Get some of them goose! Ah! Run away! 
nothing confusion about that, huh, Jack Knight? It was heartbreaking the things I did. I'll live my whole life being sorry for him. Oh, he loved it. You know, you never had it so good. It was logical to you. But why did you have to carry Bobby and me right along with you? you know, Bobby, man. Bobby understood. Bobby's dead! You couldn't understand that, you fucking jocks. In your fucking jock dreams. I was a truck driver, no nuts. They drafted me, but you! Man. Oh, he enlisted. Mr. High School Hero enlisted. Quit marching off thinking those cheese faced, brown eyed motherfuckers was gonna tackle you instead of blow you away. Don't set me straight, Jack. I stayed alive the only way I could. I rooted in what was happening around me like a pig and shit. And you're not gonna blame me and make me feel guilty. Oh, you're me off the ground, moth in the chopper, and he's screaming like a rabid dog. Oh, take it loose! Oh, yeah, you so close to lucky mates. I thought you were trying to corn me, man. I can't, it's not the million makes that ever happen. We should have stayed put, motherfucker. We should have stayed put, but we didn't! Come on, you! Oh, yeah, Bobby, now you're throwing out of the chopper. The commanding officer is threatening to shoot. Oh, sir, you chicken shit, Davey! I heard you. I heard you. You were scared and tight, and you landed bone your ankles broke. Bobby and I came back for you. That's when I got hit. I lay there in the mud with blood pumping out of my chest, and I heard. No, Bobby, don't go back for him. Fuck me, Jackknife is dead. No, Bobby, don't go back for him. But Bobby did go back, huh, Davey? You can't walk away from that, Davey! Cause Bobby did! Bobby did! Bobby did! One of the best times I ever had. It doesn't have to end. If I've been fooling myself, I can fool myself even longer. I can't. You know, I bet that we would have left that prom dance early. Yeah, we would have gone uh, somewhere to uh, dinner at a fancy restaurant. Oh, we can't have cheeseburgers on prom night, won't we? And then we would have gone for a drive. Someplace quiet and parked, and then who knows? Who knows? I'm a little nervous. It's prom night. We've been hugging and kissing in the back of your 57 Chevy for hours. And we've met Randy. Let's go upstairs. <laughs>